Have you ever thought about starting your own online petition? Online petitions can be a critical piece of an activist's mission to instill positive change in the world. The best part is, starting an online petition is easier than it sounds. In today's video, we'll look at how you can make your own online petition to kickstart your social cause. I'm Alex from Jotform. Let's begin. With all of the recent changes in the world, it's natural to feel uncertain about the status quo. Sometimes, the sheer number of injustices we witness in our society leads us to be complacent. Even still, many people have the opposite reaction and want to work towards a better future. Activism is a way for people to make their voices heard, and it can take place in many forms. In the year 2020, we witnessed millions of demonstrations in support of the Black Lives Matter movement. In fact, over 19 million people signed the Change.org petition to call for justice for George Floyd. Online petitions can clearly draw support and attention to a cause, but some still question their efficacy. Is an online petition an essential step in your mission to create change in the world? Critics of online petitions refer to them as selectivism, as creating and signing petitions takes little effort. Despite these criticisms, there's still reasons activists should utilize online petitions, such as, Online petitions are an alternative form of activism for those who aren't comfortable participating or are unable to participate in public demonstrations. The psychological impact of committing to a petition can affect the signer's behavior in the future, encouraging them to continue supporting the cause in ways they may not have before. Online petitions provide the organizer with an idea of who is interested in their cause, as well as an opportunity to encourage further action from supporters. Lastly, an online petition might be the only way someone becomes aware of a cause and awareness is essential. Though online petitions can provide significant benefits, they should be a part of a broader strategy to be effective. As an example, you might use an online petition to encourage people to join a demonstration. This way, you take the broad reach of an online petition and funnel it into further activism. One thing is for sure, and that is your petition will be most effective when you're clear about what you aim to achieve and how your petition will help to get you there. If you choose a passionate statement for your headline, like stop the destruction of the rainforest before it's too late, it may fall short when it comes to illustrating how your petition will contribute to its goal. One route many activists take is to choose a decision maker who has the power to fix the issue. Targeting an individual with power and outlining the steps you want that individual to take helps signers to feel more inclined to participate in your cause. Once you have a clear message and an idea of how your petition fits into your strategy, you'll need to choose the right online service to host your petition. While there are many services out there, not all are created equal. Some sites have been accused of allowing fake signatures to infiltrate their petitions, undermining their legitimacy. For instance, Former employees of Change.org have accused the site of misrepresenting fundraising efforts and keeping the profits intended for petitions to themselves. Even worse, in rare cases, signers are at a risk of having their personal information exposed. This is why it's essential to do your research and avoid connecting yourself to an unethical organization. Take note of what other well-known activists are doing and stay up to date on news surrounding your service of choice. Beyond ethics, there are some other things to consider. Some large services might have a low barrier of entry, allowing people to sign without making an account, meaning you can easily lose control of your valuable signer data. To avoid issues like these, try creating a custom petition through a form service like JotForm. This allows you to have more control over your petition, ensuring it's viewed as legitimate and enables you to gather email addresses to stay in touch with signers. Even more, JotForm offers valuable features like the e-signature. Digital solutions like these are an effective way to support other forms of activism in the future. The key takeaway here is changing the world is hard, but making your own petition is easy, especially when you use JotForm's petition templates. These easy to use templates help you to create a narrative, share your petition and advance your goals. Let's take a moment to look at what we learned today. While critics of online petitions might refer to them as slacktivism, online petitions benefit a cause in many ways. 
They are best for those who aren't comfortable or are unable to participate in public demonstrations and provide the organizer with an idea of who is interested in their cause. In addition, they're an opportunity to encourage further action from signers. Online petitions should be one part of a larger activism strategy as they can be a great way to encourage others to join your cause. Be sure to clearly state the purpose and mission of your petition instead of relying on flashy headlines. Once you have the right messaging, focus on finding the right online service. You can either search for a site with a good reputation or simply create a custom petition through a form site like JotForm. As always, thanks for watching. Again, I'm Alex from JotForm. See you next time.